Ronnie Brunswick, soccer body launches probe after locker room video of Suriname vice president Ray. raises integrity issue Suriname is a South American country with a population of nearly 600,000, but Brunswick has just taken time out from his vice presidential duties to captain the club that he owns, Inter Moengotopo, in a CONCACAF league match. A second-tier international club competition Inter eventually lost 6-0 against Honduras inside CD Olympia on Tuesday, according to the official CONCACAF match report. Brunswick made history by becoming the oldest player, at 60 years of In a video shared on social media, Brunswick appears to be handing out cash bills to people in the CD Olympia locker room, before leaving with a shirt of the Honduran club. The matter is being referred to the CONCACAF Disciplinary Committee who will commence a formal investigation and a further update will be provided when the process has concluded. We did our job Brunswick get pulled on the number 61 shirt for the club that he owns, but his involvement in the match has also raised questions as to whether he had disrespected the competition. CD Olympia player Johnny Leveron spoke to the press following the game, saying that each team is free to make whatever decision they think is best. It's a situation for our opponents, we don't get involved in that," said Leverin, who said he thought a lot of attention was being paid to Brunswick's appearance. Like I said, today we did our job," he added. A journalist also asked Gustavo Regi, CD Olympia assistant coach, if he felt disrespected by Brunswick's appearance. Regi said they found out that the vice president would play half an hour before the game started but said it was a matter for Intermo and Godoko, not his team. Whoever is in front of us, we have to give our all said Regi. Suriname is a former Dutch colony which gained independence in 1975. Everything I have, I give it to the people, Brunswick told the New York Times in January. Ever since I was a child, I wanted to help others. I now have the chance to help the whole country. John Santoki was elected president at the time and referenced Brunswick's checkered past. Mr. Brunswick has his history. We could look at his history and see that as a barrier, Santoki told the New York Times. We are looking forward to a better future because we are two leaders who have been entrusted to leave this nation together. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.